from Doing Your Science Experiments and today's video we're back with another awesome and amazing video and in this video we're going to do a really cool experiment and its name is oh, wow. <laughs> Air contains oxygen and other gases uh. <laughs> that air contains more than one gas. So, what are we waiting for? Let's start the experiment! Here are the things we will be needing. An empty big jar, a candle, food coloring to make the water a little bit colorful, and Play-Doh, and a um, basket or a uh, bucket, whatever you call it. Step number one is to uh, put five drops of food coloring in the water to make it a little bit of colorful, okay? One, two, three, four, five. And Polly, you can mix it. Wow. wow, it really looks like a dark color of water. Step number two, place a modeling clay in the middle of this bucket. Can I do? Okay. And now, Polly, you can fix this candle um, on the Play-Doh. Like this. So guys, this is how the Play-Doh should look like. Is to mm, pour the water in this bucket. Step five: light the candle with the help of an adult. So the next step is that we need to take this glass jar and upturn it on the candle. OMG guys, can you see this? The flame put out by itself. So guys, now I'm going to provide you with an explanation. So, burning requires oxygen. The candle continued to burn until it used up all the oxygen in the air inside the jar. When the oxygen was all finished, the flame of the candle was put out. As there was no more oxygen in the jar, the water in the tub rose up to take its place. But the water did not fill the jar completely because the remaining air in the jar contained other gases like nitrogen and carbon dioxide. Hey guys, it's now time to end the video. Hope you enjoyed this experiment and don't forget to try it at your homes and mail us at the given address below. And also don't forget to subscribe to our channel and follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Bye!